your man, Mr. Chief, shall be fam in the building. You know what we doing right about now. We rocking out and we breaking records. Radio, baby. Let's do it. Hey yo, hey yo, it's your boy Monster Man Rocco. It's your boy Swagger Rock. This is Snack Ripper. And hey, you rap for those who don't know. This is Master Ace. You are not rocking with the best. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records, man. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records. Breaking Records. Breaking Records Radio. Let's go. Breaking Records Radio. Press five nine. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records, man. Radio is like the place to be. I don't fuck strange music, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's a, you know, when you just said that too, it made me think of something that I never really put, like, realized, but, like, you know, when you guys are doing that stuff, like, spending time in New Orleans and stuff too, like, you guys are probably getting privy to, like, some of the music going on down there, like, the bounce music and stuff like that too, right? Because, right. like, that stuff didn't have no mainstream attention at the time, so, like, it had to be pretty cool going into all these different cities and stuff and just seeing, like, the different sounds of hip-hop that there were all over just America alone, you know what I mean? Like, all these different regions had these different sounds and pockets and vibes, like... Bird and mother, because, you know, from, from coming where you're you from, you can be, 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 like, the only reason popping. New York rap and shit, and you go out there, it's like, oh, what the fuck is this? Yeah. Another nigga doing what he doing, and he's bubbling crazy, and we like, why we ain't from here to hear about this nigga, or whatever, same way, so... That's how we, I guess, we branched over because we was being New Orleans. Yeah, I was, we knew everybody around the world. Texas and shit when we was first going on the blue line. So it was like, it was different. So you just wanted to, I guess, just, yeah, all that shit coming into the artist. You know, you took all of that type of shit out. Yeah. And run with that shit and feel like it was a vibe. So you just put all the vibes together. That is. Yeah. Oh, and curious too, like, um, with your time with Biggie, like, what, do you have any, like, super funny memories of, like, the time you spent with Biggie? I ain't a big old time, you know. Well, before you got a big one, you should do his thing, um, chill out, or, well, not chill out like that, but, you should be, like I said, I used to be around people that was around Biggie a lot, like, catching with Biggie, we both was the artists, or whatever, whatever was going on, you know, at the time. And, um, you know, we blow it down. Oh, with that plug-in, let me see what the first thing I'm seeing on. Shit, I feel like this. The Nintendo C is like a, uh, not Nintendo, what do you say, though? Like Nintendo, you can play, first, you can first play the game, and you can play music while you racing the car type shit. They were playing the Lost Boys shit. I mean, I was crazy. Not only that, there's so much shit that went on before I, 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 I'm at now. You know what I'm saying? The story was crazy, but yeah, we were party you guys did? Huh? Do you say that was Biggie's birthday party you guys did? Yeah, it was a Biggie, Biggie birthday party. First record came out, party of bullshit type shit. Woo! We did, we did that motherfucking joint over there. We did it, blasted off in Brooklyn. It was crazy. Oh, man. That would be dope if there was video footage of that shit. It's pretty, it's pretty, it's, it is video footage. Is it? Okay, I'm dope, dope. Okay, dope. We just started again. That's the thing, man. So much, like, you know, in, in the early hip-hop days, like, you know, there's so much shit that happened where it's, like, you know, it's it's just too bad it wasn't being, like, you know, like, well-documented, like, you know, like, videotaped and, you know, like, shit like that. Because right, you right. look back now, like, at the time, it was just a thing that was happening, right? But looking back now, you're like, man, that was just a room full of legends fucking vibing. You know what I mean? Like, back then, it was right. just like, yeah, yeah, it's a birthday party. But, like, now you look back, it's like, whoa. Hell, yeah. This shit is crazy, like, shit. That's crazy. Yeah. That's crazy, man, you know. Just to be able to come up through all that, you know, and just... Like just just witness it firsthand, you know what I mean? It's so that's it's crazy, and you know you don't, you don't realize at the time like, well you probably, but like you know like that this is all just legendary shit, you know what I mean? It's just kind of regular as it's happening, yeah, we and just, then we just racking, and we just yeah we just rapping and throwing bars at each other and living. It. Yeah. And then that shit just became like just incredible, incredible. Yeah. 
That's crazy, man. 